welcome back to Two Non Blondes. And today we will be doing a tutorial on how to make these cute little baubles, or otherwise known as ornaments. <laughs> um, we just we love British stuff. So we made a couple different ornaments, um, and we each are going to show a little tutorial on how to do them. So let's get started. So the things that you're going to need for this ornament is a clear ornament, some Mod Podge, glitter, any color you prefer, a Q-tip, and also you're going to need a palette for your paint. I chose white for the snowflake, classic snowflake, and also two paint brushes, one for your Mod Podge and one for your paint. So what you're going to do is you're going to open up the cap and pour your Mod Podge into there. That's about how much you're going to need. Now using your paintbrush, you're going to smear it around to make sure that all the sides are covered. You of course can do other methods, like you could roll it around to get those all covered. Now using the glitter, you're going to pour it directly into the ornament and you're going to shake it up so that it gets covered by all the Mod Podge. Inside it's going to look gold, on the outside it looks a little white, but don't worry, the Mod Podge will dry clear to make sure that the gold will show. Next, we're going to use our white paint and pour it on our palette. To make your snowflake, paint six lines with the white paint. Then, paint smaller lines to make it look even more like a snowflake. This is the final product, and now, on to the next one! So for this one, you're going to need a clear ornament, some nail polish, I'm using green, but you can use whatever color you'd like. Some glitter, I'm using red, some Mod Podge, and you're going to need two paintbrushes, one for your Mod Podge and one for your nail polish. So now I'm going to pour in a little bit of nail polish and then I'm going to tilt the ornament around just to get all the sides covered. Like this. Then I'm going to take some Mod Podge and with my paintbrush I'm going to paint all the sides. And then I'm going to sprinkle on some glitter. This is what it should look like. Don't worry about the white, it will go away once it's dry. On to the next one. So now you're gonna need an ornament and some Mod Podge. Some fake snow, usually this is for windows, but it also works for ornaments too. You're also gonna need a Sharpie, a couple of buttons, two googly eyes, an orange pipe cleaner, and also you're gonna need some scissors. Now you just spray some snow into your ornament, and with the Mod Podge, you are going to glue some googly eyes onto your ornament. This is how it should look like. Then you're going to cut your orange pipe cleaner and shape it into a nose, and Mod Podge it to your ornament. And then, using Mod Podge, glue on some buttons for a smile. And to make this a little cuter, I wrote a quote on the back from the fellow snowman, the one and only Olaf. This is what it looks like from the front. On to the next one. So for this one, you are going to need a big round ornament. And some battery pack lights, some Mod Podge, some glitter, and a paintbrush. First, you're going to use your paintbrush to cover all of the sides of your ornament with Mod Podge. Then sprinkle on some glitter. I'm using green, but you can use whatever color you'd like. This is what mine looks like. Now you're going to put some lights in your ornament and make sure you carefully put on the lid so that there is a little space for the wire to come out of your ornament. And there you go. On to the next one. For the last ornament, you will need an ornament, which I already wrote on mine, which we'll show you how to do. Then you're gonna need some nail polish. I chose a super cute blue one called Fuzzy Coat by Sally Hansen. And also, of course, you're gonna need a Sharpie. For this one, I wrote holy in cursive and pretending like the sun is coming from my left, I'm going to shade the areas that are going to be hit, like so. Then, pour your nail polish into the ornament and use a paintbrush or any method to coat the inside. There you go! So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that 
you liked this video, and if you did, please give it a big thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe. See you later!